In today's video, I'll be sharing some styling tips to help you make the most out of your accessory. So let's dive straight in. So first off, if you hadn't watched my previous video, let's have a look at this beautiful piece of accessory. My goodness, every time I touch this bag, I hold it, I look at it, I get so excited from inside. And I think that's the key thing, is when you're purchasing something, that's exactly how you're supposed to feel, the excitement. So every time you go to reach for that bag, it brings up joy in you. Is that sad? <laughs> I love it so much. And that's exactly how I shop, especially when it comes to luxury items, is that if I get that feeling of seeing it again and again, that's exactly the way I shop. So if I go into the store, I fall in love with it the first time, then I go in again, have a look at it again, and then again. I don't care how many times I have to go in to make sure that I love the piece that I'm purchasing. That's how I shop. I'm not gonna. I'm not an impulsive buyer. Actually, sometimes I am, but not with, um, not if I have to depart with a lot of money. <laughs> I'm not an impulsive buyer. But when it comes to buying, I do. I plan it out properly so that it's not wasted, and I know that whatever I'm buying is a classic piece. It looks sophisticated and it's gonna last a lifetime. That's probably the three main things that I always have in mind when I'm shopping. So anyway, enough about that. Let's have a quick, quick review of this. So that's the inside of the bag. And once you open it, you've got a little gold zipper inside. I still have my tissue inside and I'll keep that in there for as long as I use the bag. And the reason being is because sometimes when you're putting in your lipstick or your lip liner or small little pieces, it does make a mark on the bag. And if for whatever reason I decide to sell this on, um, I don't want to, to keep it in perfect, pristine condition. So that's the reason why I always, at the bottom of my bag, have something, or alternatively, um, I'll try and put a link up, but you can buy inserts for bags, and there's lots of brands, and I know Amazon have a lot as well, so I may consider doing that, but the only thing is, is that if you add an insert, it reduces the space inside, so that's something I need to consider if that is what I'm doing. Um, so this little, uh, flap over is actually really good. It prevents your items from inside the bag falling out. So I like that idea on here. So it kind of sits like that and um, pickpocketers will probably have a bit of a field day trying to get into here. Um, the other thing was it comes with a strap. It fits really nicely across. That's how it sits. But I'd be wearing this with all my nude outfit ideas that I'll show you today. So outfit number one is just a plain blue jeans. These are slightly wide legged and these are from Masumi Dati in, I can't remember what size they are, but this paired up with a nice pair of shirt, something like this. Tagging in the shirt on one side gives it a more casual look. This combination is great for everyday wear or even a relaxed weekend look. For a more polished look, you can layer it up with a blazer or a cardigan. Add sophistication to it and it ties the outfit together and by pairing it with some wedges or heels, it just gives it a bit more of a polished look. This is one of my favourite looks. For a chic daytime look, you could pair this up with a flowy wide leg trousers. These are from Reese. And because of the neutral tone of the bag, it will complement the simplicity of the outfit. You can complete the look with a pair of nude sandals and minimalistic gold jewellery just for a touch of elegance. So this is another one of my favourites. It's just a simple plain black dress with buttons going all the way along at the front and a little split at the front too. And it's just so easy to wear. You literally just throw this on, put the bag next to it and you look so glamorous and it looks like you've put a lot of effort in your outfit. So this is just clean, plain and simple yet very effective. And there you have it three fabulous outfit ideas to style the new bag in nude. Remember, this bag is versatile accessory that can effortlessly elevate any look, whether it's for daytime, outings, or a glamorous evening event. And as we're coming into the autumn months, this outfit is perfect from spring to summer transition. So with this, in the winter months, I'd probably pair it up with a um, knee-high pair of boots and a long coat over it, more of a camel coat. And that would really make a difference to your outfit. I hope you found these styling tips helpful and inspiring. Don't forget to let me know in the comments which outfit idea was your favorite. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed my video, please make sure you subscribe. That will mean so much to me. And if you want 
press the bell notification so that you don't miss out on my next video. See you again, bye.